Hey guys, so today I want to try upgrading the camera on this Mobula 6. The Runcam Nano 3 is pretty good, but I'm kind of a image snob, so I want to make it a little bit better. And so what I'm going to use, I'm going to use this other 3D printed canopy that I put on here. And then I also have a Cadex Baby Rattel. In my opinion, this is the best nano cam that you can get right now. Now it's going to add some weight to it. Uh, I'm going to weigh this originally with this TPU mount that I have on here, and I'm going to do that. This TPU mount is a little bit heavier than the stock mount, but in my opinion, the stock mount is garbage and not really worth using anyway because it induces way too much jello. So let's go ahead and weigh this with the setup as it is right now. And I'm showing 20.6 grams. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get this off of here, uh, clip these wires, solder the new camera on with the new canopy on and then we will weigh it again again that's 20.6 20.6 grams right now all right so here it is with the baby retail installed now before we weigh this i want to let you guys know that i'm working on a video here with the new tiny hawk 2 race where i'm putting about the largest props you could possibly fit on here not really sure how this is going to go so if you're interested in uh, seeing that go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell to get notified when this video comes out it should be out in the next week or so I'm also going to be installing this new frame from MicroHeli on the Tiny Hawk. So that'll be pretty interesting as well. I like this frame. It'll be fun to see how that works out. Okay, let's go ahead and weigh this uh, little beast now and see how much pork we have added. All right, so now we are sitting at 24.7 grams. So we have added basically four grams to the total weight of this quad. Now that's a lot. That's like 20%. So it's probably going to be slower. I mean, it's definitely gonna be slower, probably going to get worse flight times, but I'm curious for my uses where I just, you know, I just fly around and have fun. I'm not racing or anything like that. If the improved image is going to be worth the reduction in performance. So let's get some flight footage now and see how she flies. All right, well, as you can see from that incredibly short video, that didn't work out. It's too, it's too heavy. It doesn't fly well. It's way underpowered. It, it prop washes horribly now. It just really ruined the flight characteristics. You know, adding 20% onto the total weight is, is unsurprisingly probably going to do that. So in this case, I think this is going to be called a failure. Uh, I'm going to put the old camera back on and just live with the lower performance of the camera. As you can see though, man, that's a good looking picture on this camera. I'm going to be putting this camera on every quad that I can, which unfortunately this just isn't one of them. So, all right guys, well, I appreciate you hanging out with me and uh, we got some more cool stuff coming up soon. So be looking forward to seeing you then.